Welcome to this session. We are talking today about the communication happening within the Alfresco repository service and the solar service inside the Alfresco platform. Alfresco repository is the core service of the platform and it's providing all the basic content services mainly using a REST API layer. And solar service, also named internally as search service, is providing the searching features in the product. Before moving on with the communication modes, let's review all the interactions happening between both services behind the curtains. Searching feature is uh, sending request from repository to Solar. That means that repository internal Java HTTP client is sending request to Solar Yeti server. Hence, configuration related to this feature must be done in global configuration file for repository and also in GT configuration file for solar. Indexing feature is sending requests from solar to repository since search services is getting information in order to update solar cores. That means that solar internal Java HTTP client is sending requests to repository Apache Tomcat server. In this case, Configuration is happening in core configuration file for Solar, but also in Apache Tomcat configuration file for repository. Let's move now to the different modes available in a Fresco product to establish this communications request. Alfresco platform is providing three different communication modes between Alfresco repository and Solar. When using the HTTP mode, the communication happens in plain HTTP with no authentication. That means that REST API endpoints, both in repository and solar, must be protected. MTLS mode uses digital certificates to authenticate the request. So this is the safest configuration available. Finally, secret mode, available only from ACS 7.1, uses a solid secret word in HTTP headers. Since there, is, since there is no formal authentication, security is higher than using the HTTP mode. We are starting with the HTTP mode, reviewing configuration and, and settings, um, and verifying how that works on a real deployment. HTTP configuration for Alfresco repository include a set of properties to be added to a global configuration file. This mode is set in the solar secure comms uh, property that must be known for this configuration. Since Apache Tomcat is configured by default to use plain HTTP connections in port 8080, no changes are required for this server. Search services global configuration file uses equivalent properties. In this case, Alfresco secure comms must be set to none. Like in the repository site, Yeti server the file configuration is working as expected. So no, no changes are also required uh, to this component. Um, as we said before, this configuration is not including any protection against unauthorized access. So additional configuration is required in order to protect both services. In this sample, a uh, web proxy is used for to forbid the access to repository API and also uh, to add a user password authentication for the Solar Web Console. Despite the UI Applications like SER are working as expected. Let's uh, see that search things are working fine. Let's see what happened with the REST uh, API for the repository. That is this one. So we get a forbidden. So the Alfresco REST API is not available. And the Alfresco Solar Web Console is asking for authentication, is asking for the credentials we uh, set in, in this uh, file. That's all for the HTTP configuration. Let's move with the following one.
NTLS configuration is using mutual TLS protocol. So keystore and trustor files containing electronic certificates are required. We are using sample keystore for this deployment, but you can build your own using uh, the Alfresco SSL generator tool. But uh, the, the Alfresco global configuration in this case includes the mode setting in Solar Secure Comps again, and it must be HTTPS for this configuration. Additional properties uh, with the location of the key stores and the type are also included in this global configuration. Related to the credential settings, they should be configured by using Java environment variables so that sensitive information is not stored in any file. Apache Tomcat also requires, requires additional configuration. A new SSL connector running in port 8443 um, must be added to the server configuration file. And this connector is using the same key stores and trust stores used in the Alfresco configuration file. Related to the search services, uh, the global configuration file use equivalent properties. And in this case, Alfresco SecureCon's property needs to be set to HTTPS. And also um, additional properties with the location of the key stores and the type are included. As before, additional properties with the location of the key stores and the type are also include as Java environment variables. Jetty, Jetty server, also need to be configured in order to use the key stores and to start listening using TLS protocol. And again, the same key stores are used for this configuration. Since the uh, authentication is protected in this mode with electronic certificates, no additional configuration is required. The UI is working as expected. We can see that we are getting results. Uh, we have no access uh, to the um, Alfresco repository or SAPI. And if we try to access to Solar, then we are getting like this select certificate because it requires a client certificate authentication. If you install the provided, uh, the provided client certificate, you can gain access to the Alfresco Solar web console from your own uh, browser. And now it's time to move to the final um, authentic, uh, communication mode between Alfresco and Solar. The last mode available, the secret one, is using a shared secret word in HTTP headers. Alfresco repository is using also global configuration file to set the mode in solar secure comms, uh, that in this case is secret, and an additional property, solar search secret, that is including the secret word. Since Apache Tomcat is using default connector in port 8080, no additional configuration is required. Search services, as we have seen before, use similar properties for the configuration. Alfresco secure comms needs to be secret, and um, Alfresco secure comms secret is including the secret word we use in the repository configuration. Yet it is properly configured by default, so no chains are required, and this protocol, since it's not as secure as the previous one, it's almost preventing the access without using this header in the request. When run, running this configuration in the UIs, we can see again that this is working as expected. But when trying to access Solar or the Alfresco API, we are getting this error. If we uh, are using the right headers, like this one with the secret word, then we are able to access the resource. So uh, with that, we cover all the different configurations for Alfresco repository and Solar communication. Remember, this sample project is available for you. 
in the Alfresco uh, Labs repository and come back with additional questions if you may have. Till next time, bye.